Hello ladies and gents, I am the Rev, and this is Spaceborn, a game from developer Barack Dabat. Which appears to be one dude, and he's done a pretty damn good job for one guy. Uh, the game's $14.99 on Steam, currently, so if you want to go pick it up, as always, there'll be a link in the description. And I thought we'd take in, uh, play this bad boy, it's been a while since I had a fun space game on my channel. So... They've got multiple things here. This guy really went all out. So we've got our, our notes. Wiki, in case you get lost and you need to understand how something works. Upcoming features. Um, a trade guide. Because it has a full trading system in it. So if you like Elite Dangerous, but maybe with a, uh, more action. You might want to check this out. I mean, it's, it's a cool game. Cheap. Now, is it perfect? No. All games aren't. But, you know. What can you do? So, we're going to jump in. We're going to play the story mission. And we'll see where it goes from there. So, hold on. Let's get some. We lost the ships at the wings, but we only have two of our engines still functioning. It seems we'll be dragging in the void for a while. I don't understand where things went wrong. Maybe if we had checked for points of ambush before starting this operation, things would be different. Anyway, what's happened has happened. Now, since it seems we have the time, maybe you could tell me the whole story from the beginning. As you wish. Everything started with Zone X's plan. The mission zone was a mess, so you had to scout the area first. suffered a lot of damage. Let's check if all the functions are working. Let's check out ship's maneuvering systems. Gives you a nice little tutorial. Good. Here. Now let's try the rear thrust. No problem here. Let's try the thrusters. It's hard to tell, man. You can barely see it. Kind of tell we're going down. That's done as well. Now let's check the loop power. Whee! Watch the center of the screen. I'm worried about the turbo engines. <laughs> now let's try them out. This one also checks out. Let's take a final look at the ship navigation systems. Engines seem stable. Now let's check the energy systems and weapons. Now you can play uh, mouse and keyboard or control. Each ship has three weapon slots. Turret, laser, and missile. Each use of the weapon consumes certain amount of energy from the ship. You can follow your energy from the bar on the left. Shoot these things. Now let's try laser weapons. Okay, oh, there we go. All right, so the lasers are a little weirder. It's kind of usually uh, you can get a modification for it, but it's usually just one shot. And you can see down there, it takes a little bit to recharge. 
Of course, you can change all of that with upgrades. Last, let's look at missiles. Since we don't have a target to lock, just firing two missiles to space will suffice. Same thing, we got a cooldown. Weapons are in good condition. That's great. All functions are working perfectly. Now we can focus on our mission. I scan unidentified activity in the zone. Calling in reinforcements now would be unwise. First, we need to clear the way. According to my calculations, there are some ships approaching to that point. They will be caught off guard if you go and wait for them to come out. I see five frigate class ships approaching you. Hey, I am all over the place. It's one thing the game doesn't have Enemy detected. is You need to be always radar. on the move when fighting against frigate class ships. Yeah, yeah, I know how to fight these ships. I just gotta actually see them. And you gotta hold your lock on. What you do... End up. Beware. More are coming. And of course. In order to set the target, first you need to determine which target to focus on. You can do this with middle mouse button. If you can keep the target within your crosshair for a certain time, then you will lock on your target. Yeah, Enemy you detected. Don't, you don't wind up um, staying locked on. It doesn't have a follow function. A lot of games do nowadays. Enemy detected. Because, as usual, this we're gonna go through this, see the best stuff we can have, and then. I don't know what that was. I think Tiana knows you are here. A large group is heading your way. Be ready. We... You are surrounded. Only way of getting out of here is using the shock perk of your ship. area is clear now. I see undefined activity in the junkyard. We'd better check that area before we call our ships. Okay. Yeah, that's the thing that always drives me nuts about these games. We see how badass a ship we can have and then we gotta build it. <laughs> but that's part of the fun, part of the fun. Be careful. This looks like a zone with flies. These ships have high maneuverability. It is not possible. Yeah, I know, I understand. Enemy detected. Good point, 
mission miss on these little buggers. Oh, sorry about that, folks. Um, the game doesn't hold your cursor. Enemy detected. It's done. We can call our ships now. I've marked the most suitable warp point. Once in the open, you can call your ships. Gotta get on over here, it's all good. Whoa. Third squad, come to my coordinates. Yes, sir. See, I, I don't like cockpit views because I can't see enough of the screen. Yeah. I like being able to see my surroundings. Especially when you don't have a uh, 3D radar. You only have a flat radar. It's all good. What are you guys doing? Enemy detected. Uh oh. Sucker 4 and wait for reinforcements. Company, move to zone 4. Follow me. Everything began with the arrival of our guests. First, they spread a disease. Then they attacked.
right. Good morning, Here Commander. Go. <sighs> Where am I? Who are you? My name is Eve. I'm programmed to help you once you're awake. What about the war? Did we win? Unfortunately, we lost. There were some big battles after you were gone, but the human race lost. You might be the last human alive. Damn it. Why am I alive? How did I come here? They wanted to keep you here until a cure for the HX1Z4 virus was found. But the treatment was never found. So you still have the disease. How much time do I have? It won't be long before the virus reactivates. We have to get out of here as soon as possible. While you were asleep, doors between systems were detected. We need to get out of this system and find you a cure. Where do we go? How long was I asleep? Has it turned out who attacked us? No one else except Please me? Please let me stop you. We will have time to talk about those in the future, but not now. Now we have to focus on getting out of here. First we will put on our pilot armor, then we will get out of here using the ship at the hangar. Alright. Kinda of weird. And it won't let you run either, so he's just gonna casually walk. It does let you uh, run once you get into the main game. This is a pretty sophisticated man. I'd like strip this place and fill my ship up with stuff I think I could sell. I don't know. Why won't you let me in? That was weird. Or maybe it just took too long to open the door. Alright, I see a green door this way. This is all jacked up. Get used to this, because I don't know how long we're going to wear it. Alright. Headphones, da -da 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 -da, mankind, every language. Yeah, so the game's designed to play in, I think, any language that you want. Let's see, all right. So not I'll bad. I'll be using this ship. On the details. Yeah, don't worry. I will good. guide you through the whole learning process. Yeah, I can finally run. All right. But this game does have a lot of fun to it, I'll tell you folks. Let's get through this a beginning part. That's our first ship. You can have multiple ships, own hangars. All kinds of stuff. One thing I haven't seen is our Hi ability again. to walk around on the inside I like we just were. I uploaded myself to the ship. From now on, I'll always be with you. Well, that's some good news. I feel so alienated in the situation I'm in. You can power the engines using the engine console.
That's it. Now hold on. And I don't know if we get a bigger ship, maybe we can walk around the inside of it or what, but... I guess you have no experience of piloting a ship at all. If you'd like we have a training area close by, where we train our new pilots. I already know how to do all of that. We can leave this solar system. All the solar systems in the galaxy are interconnected. You can travel with these using these connections. Yep, gotta go into our scanner here. And one thing you always wanna do when you hit the, go to the scanner, if you hit scan, it'll show asteroids and other stuff that we can collect loot from. Nope, not this time though. So we're gonna go here. And we're gonna warp. Warp drive charging in three, two, one. There's our gate. Now we jump. I had to do a quick little adjustment to the volume of the game. It seemed like it was really loud. Jumping to target sector. Hmm. T1 Narsim Solar System. Doesn't ring any bells. There's a space station and a stargate in the system, but the stargate is out of order. Do you have a plan? This station can be a start for your treatment. You don't seem to have any other choice. And that'll be like our main mission for a while. So that's the offline stargate. Oh, we got an asteroid field. Go pick up some money real quick. But you don't want to do that till you get a drone. So, and to get a drone, we've got to go to the station here. Warp drive charging in three, two, one. I think we have some time. How long was I asleep? Well, I cannot give a full figure. 23 years after you were put to sleep, I went offline. 23 years? Yes, as I've said it's hard to tell exactly, but a long time. Ooh, that's a lot of feedback there. The old station, you just gotta click on it, let's go in. Thank you. 